digital pharmacology and today I am going to talk on ranology. We know that ranology is an anti angenal medication coming to the mechanism action. It acts by blocking lead sodium channels that is INA. It thus prevents downstream rise in cytosolic Ca2 plus concentration which translates into mechanical effects including a decrease in left ventricular wall tension and increase in coronary blood flow leading to angina relief. Coming to the availability, it is available as ranologin tablet 500 mg, ranologin tablet 1000 mg, extended release tablet in the market. Coming to the dose, tablet ranologin 500 mg, PTPC, tablet ranologin 1000 mg, extended release, PTPC, PTC according to the guidelines, coming to the pharmacokinetic parameters, apply in 7 hours, peak plasma concentration reach between 2 to 5 hours, viability 35 to 50 percent, it is extensively metabolized by CYP3A enzyme and to a lesser extent by CYP2DC, it approximately 5 percent excreted renally on change form. Coming to its indication, it is used in case of chronic angina, that is chest pain, contraindication, contraindication chance, severe renal impairment, that is PF in kidney clearance less than 30 ml per minute, and those patients should take the strong inhibitors of QIP3A such as ketoconazole, clarithromycin, melphitabine, etc. And those patients who are taking QIP3A inducers such as infantin, inovarbital, and also, it cannot be used in case of hepatic impairment patients. Coming to the adverse reactions, the adverse reactions are agitation, blooding, urine, itching, numbness, tremor, dizziness, hallucinations, nausea, and uh, fainting, etc. And these drugs are having some adverse reactions. That's why the drugs to be used according to the guidance and with caution. Thank you very much.